Hello, viewers. Uh, at the time I'm recording this, YouTube is being kind of dumb. Um, I've been uploading these, just uploading them straight to the site, but now it's making them convert the videos, making me convert the videos to QuickTime. I don't know why it's doing this. I guess maybe it's just getting picky, or maybe it feels like I don't appreciate it enough. Anyway, um, so yeah, episode three should probably be up. Actually, it should probably be up by the time you're watching this, so I just, it's just kind of fresh for me, so I thought I'd talk about it. But anyway, you're not here to listen to me gripe. You're here to listen to me gripe about this show. So here I am, griping about the show. Okay, so this episode four, titled Megatron's Sword. Hooray. So we are on in three, two, one, go. Do I have the sound off? So, I guess if you were a G1 fan, hearing the theme again would be pretty exciting for you. Especially since they didn't use it in the Beast Wars stuff. And in Armada, the opening had the narration over it usually. But I don't know, <laughs> it doesn't make up for the show's general level of horribleness. What power? <laughs> Yippee doo. And it won't be much longer before the master is restored. To the his master. Force. You know, Alpha Quintesson isn't actually working for Unicron. Hasbro, like, all throughout the show's run, was like, no, Alpha Quintesson is the villain. He's, he's trying to revive Unicron. He's Unicron's servant, and he isn't, <laughs> really. That's not the intent the writers had. He's got a very... He's reviving Unicron because apparently in this show, Unicron can not only destroy worlds, he can also recreate them. Doesn't make much sense. He's Unicron the Destroyer, so how come he can create stuff? He's supposed to break stuff. But um, that's what he's trying to do. He's trying to use Unicron's power to rebuild his home planet. And it doesn't... It kind of struggles to the surface sometimes. I'm oh, Megatron again. But it doesn't really... They kind of ignore it. No. Do what? Why would they want to revive Megatron? This makes zero sense. And shouldn't it be Galvatron? His name was Galvatron when he died in the last series. I really shouldn't be asking that though, because I know the reason for it. It's because you know, Hasbro wanted to keep the trademark on Megatron's name. They could only do so if he was still called Megatron. And Megatron is more recognizable and marketable name than Galvatron. And Hasbro is a toy company. That's always what they're thinking of. How marketable it is. Oh yeah, training the power link. It's no use. Catch you later. I don't... You can already power link with Optimus and you're pretty powerful, but in this show, power linking has no purpose. Usually they use it in straight up firefights. And this is too fucky word for word. But the, um... The Autobots usually engage... Yeah, in firefights. And if you power link, that means there's less guns to shoot because you've got two people combined into one. There's no purpose for it. Okay. Back on Mars, I guess. Padlock! He's alive again! so long. We sent a transmission days ago, and ever since we discovered this Energon supply below Mars City, my sensors have been acting up. I know about the Energon supply, Gary. You don't have to remind me. Before attack, we don't have enough firepower to withstand a battle on our own. Yeah. His buddies would know all that. Yes, like, blue stars! Still strangely blue stars. I know some stars are blue in real life, but they couldn't be that deep of a blue. Cons. I was hoping that you could send a support team there to investigate. There are many cons at Mars City? Yeah, Way to keep I up with your own soldiers, Optimus. Way, but they haven't responded yet. Don't worry. My voice Gary hasn't broken yet. Down, and we've taken all the necessary security it's precautions pretty weird. As well. Apprentice officers are being assembled to go investigate. They'll keep the station posted on any major developments. Good. 
I'm glad to hear that. More city? I'm Hi. very glad. I know I could teach those rookies a thing or two. You gotta let me lead the mission, sir. <laughs> teach those yeah, rookies? Right. You're trying to save those rookies. I heard you suck in every sense of the word Come meaning Hunter, suck. Let's get those minicons out of Mars City. They're an easy target and I'm worried our enemies may attack them. <laughs> What's with yes, the lighting on Dr. Jones, Jones there? But I don't like the idea it's of Batman that villain lighting. Unguarded. Has Optimus lost it? He can't abandon Mars City. Remember, we can't mine Energon without the help of the Omnicons. He was just saying he didn't want to abandon Mars City. You need to listen, Kicker. That. That's it, a signal. It's coming from the minicons at Mars City. Just just Dr. Jones always look kind of stoned. The they mm -hmm. won't identify themselves. I think they're in trouble. I'm sweaty. Intruder! Prepare <laughs> to fire on my command! Bad luck! Wait! And he has a mouth! Transformer! I think I've seen this one before. Yes, I recognize him. His name is Tidal Wave. Well, I'm not taking any chances. Tidal Wave. Tidal Wave. Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. Seriously, no one sent out a signal these guys oh they thought they were dead. But even so If they were alive, why hadn't they made contact with one now? My mouth did not move there. Okay, but what are you doing here? So have you come to guide us back to Earth? That's right. We found an undiscovered cache of raw energon not far from here. Why do you ask? Tidal wave is kind of this dim. Be some kind of a trap. Tell the minicons to hold their ground. They understand. Those Rats. weren't minicons. They were ordinary Autobots. Stop calling them minicons. Ah, oh, generic explosions. No, don't, don't, don't talk, honey. It, it's not working for you. <laughs> Pose. Hey, Sona run range at school. Why are we yellow? We weren't in the last show. I remember when everyone was after those guys, wanting to use them, become a new powerful sword, now it's just like, eh, forget about them. See, those are mini cons. Those other guys weren't mini cons. Those three. I'm not a mini con! Mine! I speak pretty one day. Demolisher always seems confused. I mean, more so than everyone else. Doesn't anyone tell him what's going on? Hey, Demolisher, we're going out to Vegas. Bye. Oh, uh, oh terrible animation. Uh. <laughs> I wish for you. I don't. You know, you thought they were going to attack Earth last time, but they didn't. There's still people in the city. But there are bases other than all those two planets. You really suck at being a leader. So what do you want us to do? This squad will not go to Mars. It will remain at this base and defend Earth's bases. But you just said As you wanted to... Yeah, I don't get you! We're staying put until further notice. I bet Armada Optimus would have helped. In fact, any other Optimus from any continuity would have helped. Except for this one. I guarantee you. Well, you're not in command, kids, so shut up. I mean, I'm not defending his decision, but you're not going to be any better. That's, those Come weren't your on. orders. Show yourselves. I'll take you all on myself if I have to. You okay, what are you going to do? Throw I'm fish fine. at them? Just mind your own business. Easy. I hate this What's kid. Gotten into you? Nothing. My I horrible personality is it's a flaw of mine. The space <laughs> Schnappy! Dang, it's never Schnappy. So Optimus was right. Did I miss something? Oh, you missed a lot. Oh, Cyclonus, you're here. Hey. Um. 
Tee hee. Huh? Who's that with the monster? Take it easy. He's not an enemy. What? Listen, Ironhide. <laughs> Could you get your hand out of my face? A friend. Oh, too close, Ironhide. Too close. Back. That's right. Back. Punch him. That's how men say hello. I'm gonna hit you so hard it'll make your ancestors dizzy. By missing every punch and doing it really slowly. What do you mean reactivated? You wouldn't know who Scorponok is. Yeah, because that's how Demolisher talks. <laughs> totally. What's with them? Who knows? The bro ants is strong. Is there uh, mini -cons you know from Mars? Three of the mini cons from Mars. Hey, they made it. Welcome, Sonar. It's good to see you again. Sonar, what's the situation on Mars? We're screwed, man. I understand. <laughs> So the Minicons are the reason that Transformers Armada is commonly known as Pokeformers by people who hate it. Um, because the Minicons were these little, cute little creatures that you couldn't really understand what they were saying, and they um, were used, they were very powerful, and the goal was to collect as many as possible, and yada yada. I really think that this show is more like Pokemon in terms of cheesiness, though. Except Pokemon is way more high quality than <laughs> this. And even Armada at points. Okay. Part two in a bit.